Hey, I'm Ty, and you're watching the DJI Spark tutorial video series. In this video, we'll show you how to update Spark's aircraft and remote controller firmware. Now, as long as a network connection is available and you've connected Spark and the remote controller in the past, the DJI Go4 app will automatically search for firmware updates and let you know if updates are available. When a firmware update prompt appears, tap Download Firmware to begin. Ensure you're connected to a Wi-Fi network with internet access. Otherwise, you'll need to download over your cellular network and data charges may be incurred. After downloading is complete, the updates need to be installed. Power on the aircraft and the remote controller. Ensure the remote controller is linked to the aircraft. Confirm that the aircraft has at least 50% battery life and the remote controller has at least 30% battery life. You can also update the remote controller and the aircraft individually if you like. If you're ready to update, tap Update Now. Don't turn off either device's power or exit the app during the update. And if the remote controller loses connection with the app during the update, follow the instructions on screen to reconnect. A prompt will appear in the app when the update is complete and the remote controller will start beeping. Reset the remote controller to complete the update. If a prompt appears saying that the update has failed, restart the remote control or drone, then try updating again. Aircraft firmware can also be updated with DJI Assistant 2. Connect the aircraft to your PC or Mac with a USB cable and ensure your computer is connected to the internet. Launch DJI Assistant 2, which is available to download on the official DJI website. Enter your DJI account information and select Spark Click Firmware Update on the left and choose the latest firmware version. Click Update Now to start updating. And that's how to update. If you have any issues with the update process, please contact our support team at www.dji.com backslash support. Now join us in our next tutorial, where we'll look at one of Spark's most exciting features, QuickShot Mode. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.